Hi everybody, it's Nita Sweeney, author of Depression Aids a Moving Target, down in the ravine with Miss Scarlet. We are doing a long run today. I'll probably do about 10 miles, just getting started. I'm about a mile in, and I'll probably take her back home after three or four. She's done six so far, that's her longest. So today, in my running meditation, I am noticing, because it's Saturday here, that there are a lot of mowers and leaf blowers and engine sounds, cars, things like that. Um, just a lot more people out in their yards working with electronic equipment or gasoline powered equipment. And I notice that when I hear those sounds, airplanes going over, when I hear those sounds, I have um, negative thoughts and body sensations. Not so much negative, but unpleasant. Um, they cause sensations that I don't really care for in my body and sometimes some negative thoughts. So I will use those as my object of meditation. Again, just noticing if they arise, if they do, where in my body they arise, and then allow them to kind of float away, sort of like clouds. So I'm not trying to push them away. I'm not getting attached to them. I'm just noticing that they're there, acknowledging them, and then letting them float on by. This is a little bit different than what I do with my own negative voices. Um, with those voices, I actually thank them. I talked about that in a previous, uh, previous video, where I thank them because they are a part of me that thinks it's trying to help me. And that seems to work for me. But with these, I will notice them and then do my best to just let them pass without pushing or pulling on them and um, just being open to them also. So I hope you're having a great day, whatever you're doing. If you have some kind of a running focus, a meditative type focus, whether it's a form focus or a awareness focus, a consciousness focus, I would always love to hear about that. Scarlet has found something to look at. So we'll see you later. Thanks. Bye.